fucked up. I ran them off. Excuse me. Somebody tried to steal my car right out of the driveway. Do you have a key for it? You got no, I have a key for it. Is Chance here? Yeah, Chance is here. Alright, someone's calling about him again. Hey, Chance. He's upstairs. Uh, they want to get back. Okay, okay. Get back. Go on. Chance. Dance. Watch your eyes, guys, okay? Come on, turn on the oh, there we go. Come down here. What are we gonna do about these people trying to steal my car out of the driveway? You got a camera over there? No. You got a floodlight? No. I would pull one up. We, we Oh we just got you we just Yeah, what's up? Well we'll talk to him and then I'll talk to you. How's it going, Chance? What are we going to do about this? I need to talk to him first. And then I'll, I'll talk to you in a second. Alright? What's going on? Hey, Chance, we got a call. Checking in on you. Uh, uh, I'm gonna, uh, all right, what's going on? Uh, nothing. We just had a tow company here trying to, get, trying to take our car. Had a caller checking in as, uh, saying that you were I was looking dead at ass. yourself or anything like that? Nah, I was dead ass asleep before our dog started barking and woke us up. Hey, uh, Just hanging out snoozing? Nah, nothing going on. I was, I was dead asleep. You sure about that? Any idea why we'd be getting a call in from Wyoming? People, nah, because I had won my court case yesterday and they're doing whatever they can to harass us because of it. But everything's alright? Yeah, yeah, everything's good. <laughs> you <not sleeping>? Yeah, <laughs> literally. <laughs> Breaking into the vehicle, is that what you're saying? No, I I wasn't gonna explain it. <laughs> you can better explain it than I do. Well we were sleeping and um the uh tow company I think it was right. They when I come out they had both hooks from a car and I told them to get out of here before I called the cops. Are you freebasing inquiring minds wanna know? Well, there was a car right there. I should have got the, the license plate number. You couldn't tell. Yeah, when I hey, it, bro, come on now, dog. When I came out the door, they were right there. And then by the time I got back, they were backing up. So I took a brick and I threw it at the car. At the tow well, company? Huh? At the tow company? No, at, at the car that was out here. I, there, was a, there was a tow company. And here, what, we what did he say? There was a, there was a tow company. And here, what we heard, we come out and went down that way. When I come back, there was a car that was parked right there. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. And, and, then, we, and then when I come going this way, I picked up a piece of brick that was laying right there and I threw it at the car. I, w I wish I'd get the license plate number. What does that even mean, bro? Like, that is very suspicious. Well, they were trying to take it. Is that a repo company? No, that, 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 I got a clear title right to the car. Right. So you don't have money on it? No, no money at all. All right, well, we'll keep oh. an eye out for it. I've, hey, get in there. I'd maybe get a camera over there, a floodlight. That's a great idea. Let's move. You are now traveling to another dimension. I told these trolls to lick my butt crack, and they do a good job licking my butt crack. Bing bong! Bing bong! I don't want to go to jail! I don't want to go to jail! Oh, and in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Thank you, guys.
When the spawn meets world. This is a certified hood classic. Oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, it's your boy CJ, and we back at it like a crack addict with a bad habit. And before we get into this video, that video you just seen at the starting, I just had to mention something. Doesn't it seem like he's just lying? He's just saying anything for maybe the cops to take him more serious? Dude, I don't, I can't see trolls trying to, trying to tow their car away or whatever he was saying. I just can't see it. And I'm not trying to say that trolls don't go and harass them because there's evidence of that and uh and i don't agree with that i don't think you should go bully or harass especially for my sake if you're gonna do it go and do it i just don't recommend it by any chance i find usually when you, when you tell somebody don't do it they just end up doing it so that's why i'm wording it like that uh, uh, can you like shut up uh, say what <laughs> But yeah, it's just, it doesn't seem like that was true. The way he was talking, he wouldn't really look at the cop in the eyes so much. I just think he knew he was lying. It just, it seems so evident. But that could just be me because I am biased and don't like them. But hey, I, that's just how I felt while watching it. But let's get into this. Apparently, he made a video calling out Kate Peters. AKA Mass Troll Mafia. I'm pretty sure everybody knows of her. I'm not doxing her. But uh, yeah, no, it's uh, let's get right into this, okay? This, this is gonna be interesting, I think. What a all my fellow metalheads. Oh, metalhead. Metal here. I know it's been a long time since I've been on here, but I got some shit that needs to be said. You always Without say, a doubt, this needs to be said. Cyrax, you said all you could say in the last few years, and you've just... Oh, my dog's puking. <laughs> you okay, bud? And I've said all I could say in the last couple years, couple years of covering you. So I just, I don't know what you have to say that's new. I'm just curious. And honestly, I hope this does get shared <laughs> to... YouTube and around YouTube. I hope that people do see this. And by the title of the video, I don't think it's any secret what this video is about. This is about Kate Peters, aka Mash Troll Mafia, who's a conniving, lazy, attention of a bitch. So Kate, you want to sit there and say that you made me relevant? Nah, bitch. I was relevant before your ass even came into the picture. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? No, that was not true. No one was really looking for you. That's not true. Soon as the trolls got to you, they made you famous and people found you like that so the, that's just a fact that's what happens with lol cows that's what happened with larson that's what happened with world of t-shirts it just it's just a fact it's just a fact and uh i can't believe you can't see that and you know what you probably can you're just so delusional or you're just completely denying it you want to sit there and say that oh you made me Bill, you didn't. I made you. Well, what? I. No one knew who your ass was. No one gave a f about who you were until you did what you did to me. You know what? That is somewhat true, Cyrax. You did help people's channels. That's a fact. It's just because of how oddly disgusting you are. And lol cows attract people. They're like a. They're like a human form of a car wreck. You cannot keep your eyes off of it. And that's that's you. That is exactly you. And just say, if you were just an ugly looking dude, and God was just in a bad mood when he made you, and you were just a good person overall though, you would not get this much hate. You would have bigger creators coming to your side and helping you out. Because first of all, there's some nice creators on YouTube even though there's lots of scummy ones and then even the scummy ones will help you because they know that will boost their reputation so you would have somebody clawing at you to come help you 
but no one is. There's a few outliers, but they're most likely predators or people that are too special needs to know what's right and wrong, so they just feel bad for you. And I've said this again, and I'll say, I guess I'm going to be saying it for a while because, bruh, you repeat so much stuff that I have to repeat it. Oh my, let's go. That's why people gave a f about you. Not, uh, that's not all just you, though. She was covering other people. That's just a fact. I, you want to sit there and talk your shit? Well, guess what, bitch? You give real pedo hunters a bad fucking name. What do you mean? You called yourself one. You're the one who did, you admitted to it. And I really don't think anybody made you say this and, and uh, manipulated you to say these words. I really do think you meant them. Let me just show you the two examples. I show them, but I'll show, I, I try to show them as much as I can. Let me bring you up to speed. I'm not a fucking pedophile. Look up the technical term, bitch. I would be considered a hemophile, which, by all technical terms, is not a fucking lie. By all technical terms, I would be a hemophile, which is not a crime. It's not illegal. I hope that we can when was the last time that you sent your dick to a child? I'm just curious. Like, how, how long has it been? Literally, whenever you tricked me. Literally. But what no, because you just went through two other instances after that. That was that actually that was those were actually beforehand. Those were beforehand incidences. Well, the the Chloe thing, I sent those to her beforehand, like days before, and then today she okay, had. Okay, so. So how is she? How did she? How does she give these people bad names? She caught one right you've admitted to it and i and if you're gonna say oh they made me do this i want to see the proof there's got you got to have proof of them trying to manipulate you to say this so show that where's that proof cyrax because you don't have it i don't think they manipulated you into saying it i don't think so i think they might have they might have said a few things like hey j just admit to your wrongdoings and we'll leave you alone but any sane any person that knows their rights from their wrongs like you do would know they're lying and so you would know not to fall for that but no i think that day you felt guilty and you you confessed you get real pedo hunters that actually want to help kids you make them look like shit you don't do this shit for the kids you do it for this, the Benjamins, the money. And you're you know what? Most people are like that as well. That's just a fact. But as long as they're doing it in a good way and they're not trying to manipulate people to looking bad, then I'm fine with it. If you're all about it for the money, but doing it the correct way, that is fine with me. It's just a little, it's just the icing on top. If the person cares, that's even better. <laughs> But whatever, you can never really tell who cares and who doesn't, as long as they're doing it properly and not evasively and not and uh, who's that other anxiety wars is a really good guy to watch his content. He does a good job, very professional. Attention, whore! You're a conniving, crazy, psychotic. You're a drug. You're an alcoholic, and you've openly admitted several times. Dad, you don't give a shit about the kid. See, when they don't have enough proof for their big statement that they have against that person, they have to rely on calling them other names like this, uh, uh, bitch, and this, you know what I'm saying? He's just grasping at straws. You only do it for the money. That's why you do what you do, for the money. You, Kate, are a piece of shit and honestly I hope to God you burn I do I hope you burn alive in hell and if I do go to hell well guess what bitch I'll be the one lighting your fire up and watching you burn so are see he's pretty much admitting to his wrongdoings right there if he knew he was not in the wrong and not guilty he would say he wouldn't be in hell but he just pretty much admitted it Read between well, the, I you gotta read between the lines sometimes with Cyrax. 
burn alive. I'll be kicking it with Satan and watching your ass burn alive. So you're worse than her, pretty much. So, Kate, if I was you... So you're saying you're worse than her, because if you're kicking it with Satan, that means you did a really good job of terrorizing the world, so he's letting you kick it with him. I'm reading too into it, but it's just funny. Because you don't have very many allies around now, right now. What? There's a lot of people that hate your guts. Uh, not that many. And let me tell you right now, bitch face mastroll mafia, you don't... Daddy. Marty was trolling me long before you. Yeah, but she caught you. She caught you, dude. Red-handed. I'm uh, not sure that is a possibility, though, so I will definitely keep that in mind. Oh, what? Say that. Say what the... No, like I said, oh, Kate... The mysteries. Mysteries. Marty! Music Biz Marty! Was trolling me long before you ever were, bitch. So? What does that matter? I don't get that. No, I want to the right one because I want this stream to... I want Kate to see this stream. I want her to see this. People are telling him to get off the internet. Even his own fans. I want all the trolls to see this so they know how much you're a bitch. And how much of a loser Kate Peters really is. You're doing the opposite. You're making yourself See, more guilty. Kate Peters didn't go after me because she thought I was a pedophile. No. She did it because of the fact that she wanted clout. She wanted to make money off of my ass. You weren't famous at that time, really. Don't right? blame me. I have loads of fucking proof. I have several actual... Sources that are actually legitimate, verifiable oh, sources. Uh, lie again. Lie, 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 lie. That can provide proof that Kate did what she did to me, not because she thought I was a pedophile, no. She did it for money. She's a greedy, money-hungry bitch that don't give a f about nobody but herself. Um, Why do you think she lost both of her kids? See, now... This shit. She don't give a f*** about nobody. She don't care about her own kids. She don't care about doing the right thing to actually to be a good person. It's so funny. Like we said, even if it was for the money, that doesn't really matter. She did it in a good way, I'm pretty sure, from what I've read and seen. So that's out the window. And, and Kate doing it for clout? Are you kidding me? You weren't clouded up like you are now. You're not even really clouded out. King Cobra is clouded up. But you, dude? Are you kidding me? You weren't famous at the time at all. I think she might have just found you as a funny lol cow. As may maybe reacting to you. I don't know. And then she found out about this and then started trolling you. That's what I heard from a couple different people. Then I heard a different stories. So, guys, you can tell me down below. But you weren't famous like that. There was a sliver of clout, clout at that time. I'm sh right? Am I not wrong about that? He wasn't really known at that point. A few years ago, four years ago, whenever it was. So I think that's just bull. But guys, you can tell me if I am. I might be wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure I am right. But guys, make sure you like, subscribe, do all those shenanigans, and I'm a dip. Peace out.